Hey, up campers, how y'all doing? So, got another video for you <laughs> by popular request. Well, a couple of people wanted me to hurry up and get another one out. So, as I've said before in other videos, probably you'll know me by now if you watch regular. There is a lot of swearing. There is a lot of frustration. There's a few bits of like wanting to have a mental breakdown or being on the verge of one. Oh, it's so frustrating when I've been trying to get things straight, straight and level and everything else in here because it's just really hard in a van, unless it's totally square. And um, when you've got maybe a touch of OCD and um, perfectionism, but you don't have the patience, the energy or the skills to make things perfect, it gets very frustrating. So that's all I want to say about that. Uh, as I've said in the previous videos, I think, pre yes, previous videos, check me out on TikTok if you want. I'd say it's easier to do a TikTok video because it's quicker, a lot quicker. I've just spent all morning editing this video and I could go through it again and edit more. You see, I, I take out lots of where I'm stood going, because uh, <laughs> that's not interesting, is it? And it takes a long time because it was a lot of erms. Um, just, you know, my, my poor brain just trying to work things out. Surprised it didn't explode actually. Anyway, thank you for your continued support, comments, likes, likes and shares. And subscribe if you want. In fact, just do it if you don't want. Just do it. And um, I'll leave it there. Two and a half minutes, that's long enough, isn't it, for an introduction. And, and what? I don't know. I, was, I don't know what I was trying to say then. Keep watching for more updates. See the kitchen build. I didn't record every single little thing, but I've still got 36 videos to go through to edit. I tell you, I've been re-traumatised watching me do that. So you appreciate the effort. <laughs> Just remembering how difficult it was. So I'm, li I'm living in my van now. Oh yes, I am living in it. I've done lots and lots since this was made, This all these video clips. Still not finished. It's finished enough for me to live in it, so that's good. I've still got little gem. You'll know that if you tuned into the live that I did, whenever that was. Is it Boxing Day? That's ages ago. I've done one since then. Oh, I don't bloody know. Don't know me out of me, I'll book minute. I'll leave it there because I do this stuff. I say, right, that's all. I'm not going to go on and on and on. And then I end up going on and on and on. So, right, that's it. That's it. I'm going. Bye for now. So... I'm not show you any better than I am doing. Yep, right, so I'm going to jig the top and the bottom. It's not the best angle, is it? You know, I can't... Because if I was to move my camera every time I wanted to do something to show you exactly what I'm doing, this would take me till next October. So... Just gonna have to use your imagination. <laughs> right, let's get the screws. That'll be the same size at both ends. <laughs> With any luck. I don't think what's coming next. Fucking <laughs> nervous breakdown, I think. Alright, so I've. Yeah, I've put this <laughs> two bits across. My cooker's going in here. I, d I don't know how exactly. I don't know. Because the work surface is going to be over here, and I'm going to have. It going into the window recess as well just to give me a bit more depth obviously the places where it can't do that it will just go to the edge of, edge of there edge of the unit I don't 
I don't, I don't really know. Like, without having my cooker here and putting it in slot, I, I don't know how it's going to work, to be honest. But these, these can't be here, can they? Because that's going to be in the way. Because in, in the other van, it sits, so it's about 12 inch that way. So it sits in a recess that's been made, which is what I'm going to have to do here somehow well i'll just put i'll put some struts there possibly struts at the back oh, i'm gonna do a dive there <laughs> that oh i don't bloody know but i'm gonna need struts and these bits will have to be cut out so i'm gonna make the struts now oh. Oh, how is that bloody too short? Crying out loud. <laughs> oh, that's no, that's half a centimetre out of that. Fuck. Well, she's having short bits now. So I've jigged my bits of wood. That other bit was fine, it was fine. It was just when I put the other one in, which, which was a little bit big. It was pushing this up, so it made it seem like it was too short, but it's actually wasn't. Let's do this one first. Screws. Should I do the bottom bit? Oh, that would be easier than the top. Jigged. I need to put another one there. Fucking fucker. That's a short one. Well, it seems short. I needed to put that one in first. Oh, I suppose it'll pull it down. God! There's any Christians watching. Oh, I'm too old for this shit. Why is it? Come on now. This that hasn't really helped, to be honest. straight line even when I write a bloody draw a straight line they just never end up straight which is rather annoying Aww. Aww. 
These need to come out. I can put them further down. I have to go 12 inches down because that's how big the cooker is. So that will go to. Yeah. I just need to cook. Cut these now. Put it out. Oh, I hope this is right. No, I don't know if it is. The cooker's 20. 20 inches. I mean, that's, that's 42 and a half centimetres. But actually, it's not. It's not going to... It's not, is it? Because it's a back bit. Oh, I'm going to have to measure it again. <sighs> right. This is... <laughs> All right, palaver. But my cooker is not going to fit in. Wouldn't fit into this frame. I didn't want this frame coming right out here because I could have just removed these. I'm upset already. Remove those. Made it longer so that the frame comes from. But I didn't want the frame right out. I might have to have this while I've done this one like that. So it is further out. How solid is that though? That's you know. Um. And I'm going to make this like a separate frame here. Uh, so I'll be putting a piece of wood, attaching it to that there. So it'll be resting on the wheel arch, so it's supported by that. So you probably can't see. Hey, how's that? Does not meet that. So I just didn't work it out properly. I would always advise anybody to do plans i mean things can still go wrong even when you make plans but still it's probably better anyway so i was just trying to work out how to do this how to connect these so i've got these two um i'm gonna attach those two together and then put them there and then i put a strut across it's gonna hopefully match was that one there you can see yeah so put them there then think about the front bit how i'm gonna uh, attach the front bits because i do want this i did want this further back than the cooker bit um so this will come there i suppose i'll just go straight across I think the sink will be here. Um, I'm hoping that I can get the sink that I want with that space that I've got. Uh, I have to measure it to make sure, obviously. But uh, yes, yeah, so I'm going to put those two bits of wood together and then attach them to that. Put them together. I'm hoping, like I say, it's going to connect with the other side. And that doesn't look too bad, does it? But then, all right, pardon me. Sorry, I'm just drinking fizzy water. But of course, I didn't, I would, I didn't realize that I may be parked slightly on a hill. I don't think I am. Mind you, the van, the back end of the van is high off the ground. Of course. So that is gonna do that, isn't it? But isn't it hard? It's really hard work trying to get things level and straight in a van. And you, you know, you can't use a spirit level, can you? That doesn't help. But I was like, I looked at it and I thought, oh, it's not level, it's not level. So I had to take that back bit down to try and make it level. And I don't know if that's level. And it's pissing me right off. None of it looks bloody level to me. I suppose I'll know when I get water in the sink i think that's where the sink's gonna go but yeah water in the sink i'll know what if it's level on that this is by far the biggest challenge this all this and it looks like just bits of wood screwed together doesn't look like a big deal but try honestly trying to get stuff straight and level and everything else i'm looking at that and it doesn't look right I do it like that, does that look better? <laughs> oh, whatever. Right, so, does that look straight? Does that angle, does that look straight? It's 
flat on the bottom, it's flat up the side, flat to the wood. So as far as I'm concerned, that means that angle is straight. And yet it's 19 and a half inches from there to there at the bottom and the top is not, it's smaller, it's a smaller angle. So can you tell me how that is straight at the bottom even though that piece of wood, even though it's not straight, is it? It can't be straight, but this bit, what's this top bit like? I can't hold it properly, I can't. Try to hold the camera and do this with one hand, it's not easy. But that, that's a bit fucking focus, it might help. It's impossible, it's impossible to get this fucking straight and right. It's just impossible. And it's this, this, right? So measure that the same at the, as the bottom and the top of this side. If it's straight at this side, why is this not going to be straight? I mean, look, that's not straight. It's not, oh, it's not a million miles that much. But that, even though I've measured it, it's not, look, you see where that piece of wood goes? It's nowhere near the bottom of that piece of wood. Even though this measurement is the fucking same. For fuck.